What's up, YouTube? So I, I made videos here before. This is the fire department. We got two VRF systems here. It's a Sheba carrier. Back in December, I remember it was a Saturday. The guy on call called me. He was throwing up to get the code. I come out, <clears throat> and it's compressor one is grounded. You can hear it's running right now. So to get them running, this each one of these are aboard for the compressor. So to get it running, what I had to do is come over here to switch six and for number one on switch six, we just turned it on. It's going to ignore everything for first uh, the first compressor, and this way the other two can run. Each compressor, they say, is like about 33.3% capacity. So today I'm here to replace the compressor. Right? It'll be a little fun. i got to figure out how I get this whole damn cabinet out and out of my way. Holds like 53 pounds of refrigerant. So yeah, they've been bitching this summer. It's they're hot. Yeah, you know, it's barely running what 66, 67 percent of its capacity. I think it's a six ton. So I can't. I mean, I'm not gonna. Yeah, see, he wrote 27.4. That's what they added plus the factory charge. So you know, I can't sit here and hold the camera and do everything, but. I'll show you step by step, you know, when I get all this out, what it looks like, so, alright, it's going to be a fun day. Freaking recovering here. So, you know, you got a couple of screws there, and then you had three on the bottom. Got to undo this sh shit here for the compressors and rector. So I figured I'd show you, you know, the clips, you got clips that clip in. I'm slowly trying to see if I can get it out there. And we're out. This is compressor one. Uh, I'm gonna take get this bracket out, and we'll be able to to do what we gotta do. So, not too bad. Of course, it's a Friday, holiday weekend. <laughs> All, right, All right, so it's got the cover up. These things have these belly band heaters on it. We don't want to lose it. <laughs> I'm gonna do the wiring. So I got a weld here. I got a weld here. Just try waiting on the recovery. You TVs. So I just. Unsweated it, but you notice what I did is I, I took the freaking feet off. I took the little rubbish shits off. Let the compressor drop for that weld right there, man. This one right here, man, that shit's not an easy one. <laughs> Let the weight drop it down. I figured I'd show you. We're getting there. We're getting there. Got the new compressor. We're ready to pressure test everything. Right now we're in a vacuum. So we're back together. I gotta put this back, wire up. I gotta change the board, man. It's so freaking hot, I had to get the fan. And we'll go from there. We'll see how it works. I tell you what, that this weld back here, boy, was not easy. It's not that it's not easy, it's just trying to pop it free. Easy enough, though. So we just replaced the board for the compressor. Each compressor has its own board, but you know this. It is our lead for the compressor, but you got a screw here, a screw here, there, there, and there. You take this wire, this wire, and this wire off, and these two for the reactor. Reactor. And on the bottom, you have a dip switch. And just because this is compressor one, we just have to take switch one and turn it to on for that one. But there's paperwork in there. Let's say if it's three or four, then it's a different combination. So, we're getting there. Freaking battling bees all up in this bush here. <laughs> no fun. Alright, well, it's been a long day. I just, you come over here, you know, you got dials. 251, I set it for. And this switch, switch four, you press and hold it for about two to three four seconds it's gonna go to a cooling test mode we'll see what we got going on all my compressor lights are on I still gotta weigh it in guys but you know if you come back here uh, cooling test operation so you set the dial for two five one tells you the dials and uh, push SW4 for two seconds or more. And here's your error codes and stuff, man. 
you can go in here, you don't have to hook up your gauge, you can just set your dial. One, one, two, pressure data, sensors. It's not too bad. All right, give me a few. So I took it out of check mode. Guys came back to the firehouse, they came on, they all want to talk, so. Well buttoned up, everything else checked out, you know, you saw me weighing in the charge. Uh, took it out of test mode and you can't, I don't think you can hear it. I don't know if you can see it. I, <laughs> but yeah, she's back up and running on her own. So these guys will be happy. Hi guys, see ya.